Everybody, welcome to Prince of Peace Tarot. I'm Justin, and today I will be doing a general read for the zodiac sign of Sagittarius. So if you have Sagittarius in your sun, moon, rising, or Venus, anywhere in your chart, this may resonate with you. Um, if it resonates, don't forget to like, share, subscribe, and hit the notification bell. And if you want to book a personal reading with me, you can email me at princeofpeacetarot at gmail.com. Okay. All right, so Sagittarius, let's call down your energy. All right. Hmm. Sagittarius, we'll see what we got going. Infinite Creator, Olo Dumare. To my higher self, my Ori, Eshu, Obatala. To the Egun, Merin Lae, Holy Spirit, Spirit Guides. To my benevolent ancestors, known and unknown. Florine Williams, Norman Williams, please allow me to source the most accurate reading for the zodiac sign of Sagittarius. Thank you. All right, Sagittarius. Holy Spirit, angels, guys, please allow me to source the most accurate reading. The Zodiac sign of Sagittarius. Thank you. Holy Spirit, angels, guides, please allow me to source the most accurate message for the zodiac sign of Sagittarius. Thank you. Ooh, okay. Let's see. Let's see. Uh -huh. Oh, yeah. I like that. Okay. You gotta be kidding me. This is reminds me of um Aquarius. I see the yes and the no card at the same time. Let me see something. Okay. Let's put the bottom this behind this. Oh. Let me see. Give me a second, Sagittarius. Let's take in this energy. Okay, so at the, the beginning of your spread, you have uh, the star, which is great. Um, you have the Ten of Swords, the Wheel in the Upright, and the Eight of Swords. This is nice. At least to see the star in the wheel. The star talks about renewal, hope, miracles, faith, or being in the spotlight. Somebody might actually be a star. And it's, um, it's uh, spiritual guidance. So you are being protected by the divine probably been pr praying for protection or you're um, in an endeavor of some sort um, that requires for you to have spiritual protection and you have it. I, I believe whatever you are hoping for is going to come 
to fruition. Mm-hmm. Yeah. It says, uh, after that, so we got the star, ten of swords, the will, eight of swords. So the ten of swords in reverse says you're recovering um, and that you're um, being in flow. You're regenerating. I mean, if it was in the upright, it would be, you know, a bad situation. And it, it could be that you are recovering from a negative um, situation. Could have been in your past. Could be something that you are currently going through. But you're about to have a new start. Mm -hmm. You're moving on. You're, you're forgiving and letting go and moving on. Yeah, because you have the will. And the will uh, is in the upright. It says, good luck, karma. Karma. Positive life cycles, destiny, a turning point, evolving. Yeah. And you're eight of swords. You're releasing negative thoughts. Any kind of self-imposed imprisonment, you're letting it all go. You're ready. You're ready to step into your new cycle. Um, and the divine is is assisting and guiding you to go through that, through that will. Okay. All right, so then in your uh, second part of your spread, we got the Three of Wands in the upright, Ten of Wands in the upright, the Hermit and the Three of Pen the Hermit in reverse, and the Three of Pentacles. So let me see what this is about. Okay, okay. Yeah, you're threes. Okay, you're busy. You're busy. You're very, very busy. You're, you got three of wands on both ends. You got, I mean, three of wands. You have threes on both ends. You have the three of wands over here and then the three of pentacles. Um, I've seen this before, this combination. And the person that I was reading for, um, she had a, uh, a retreat she was planning. So maybe you are planning a, uh, maybe you have a project or you're planning a big event. And because you have 10 of wands right here, it's, it's causing a sense of burden um, extra responsibility and hard work that you feel like you have. Um, yeah, it's, it's stressing you out. It's stressing you out. And this hermit is saying that you feel, maybe you feel like you're the only one dealing with it, you know, but if you are in three, if you got threes, that means there's people around you. So maybe ask for some help. Okay. You don't need to feel lonely or isolated because that's what the hermit in reverse is saying. You feel isolated, but you don't have to feel that way because um, it's not like a two of wands making a decision or waiting for something to happen. This opportunity that you have may involve travel, may involve going out of the country, may involve maybe, you know, just traveling to another state for whatever this is. But if you're not going alone, if you're dealing with the team, there's no reason for you to feel alone. OK, so open up. Speak up, okay? And then let's go to the uh, to the bottom of your spread, okay? We have the chariot in the upright, four of cups in reverse, page of cups in reverse, and then the yes card. Let me figure this out. Give me a second. Because chariot is saying we got some, some movement. Someone's honing in that energy. And moving, moving forward methodically. But there's a four of cups in reverse. So somebody is retre retreating, is withdrawing and reevaluating. Either someone's coming towards you or you were going towards something and now you're changing your mind. Okay. Take it how that resonates because, uh, you may, if you're reevaluating, you may think that there's a, a better option or something else for you. Okay. So, um, and then you get the page of cups in reverse. Okay. So this is rejecting change, doubting intuition, emotional immaturity. Uh, it, it could talk about a breakup. Yeah. Someone who's a uh, dependent and it says, yes, yes, yes. I believe to, um, Cherry talks about control and willpower. If you're retreating from this page of cups, if this is you, then they can, then yes, temper yourself. Don't go towards this person because you, 
this person, whoever they are, and the thing is, you've already gotten over them. You've already gotten over them, and and you're you're stepping into a new path. This is not even like it's they're they've only come into they above that. Okay, above this page of cups is your hermit in reverse, and it could be because you're feeling lonely. Okay, maybe because of what this immature person you dealt with in the past has done or said, but their energy actually isn't dominating um, the spread. It's not dominant. Let me see. Let me see what's at the bottom of the deck. You got the no card. Okay, so it's obviously say no. It's yes to controlling yourself. And at the top, success, public recognition, and self-confidence and achievements. Your um this three of wands, three of pentacles endeavor is gonna bring you success and public recognition. And obviously, because you've stepped into a um a good cycle. Karma says you deserve it. Mm-hmm. Yeah. And this person, this person is probably imbalanced. They could be manipulative, but you're moving into the sun. That's what I see. Sun card. Don't worry. Don't even pay that person any mind. Like legit, like legit. Your, your spread is talking about um, your project. You know, you're going to be getting that done. You may feel some little loneliness here and there, but it's that's you can get out of that. God is with you. It's going to make sure everything goes well. Your pro whatever whatever this endeavor is, your 3 of wands, this 3 of pentacles, it's going to go well. Mhm. Mm yeah. Let's see. It's going to go off well. You're going to be tired, obviously, because it's it's not a small task, but stay focused. Uh, this page is a mute, mute point within your spread. I think for you, um, Sagittarius, I will do a uh, money and career bonus for you because it looks it, you look good. You look good. The divine is with you. you got the star. You're the star. <laughs> OK. All right, guys, um, if this reading resonates with you, please like, share, subscribe, hit the notification. If you want to book a personal reading with me, it's uh, princeofpeacetarot at gmail.com. Go ahead, send me an email. And Sagittarius, I will see you later.